Hey dear friends, welcome to the the tie structure tutorial. In this section, uh, in this video, I will uh, show you how you can work with stack. So let's get started, and also please subscribe to my channel. Okay, I want to create a project data structure. Okay. Okay, now we have created a data structure project. I want to create a package for a class, for example, my stack. Okay, and also in the DS package. Okay, and also please subscribe to my channel, youtube.com slash bar no mem okay please 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 subscribe to my channel so let's get started as you can see or as you know data structure is last ten first out okay stack is last and first first out what means? Mm, it means it means for example if one comes first and then two comes second and three comes third for example, four comes fourth. Okay, here as you can see, this is the index zero which comes first. This is the index one. This is the index one which comes uh, after one. Okay, this is the index. Two and this is the index three. This is the last value, okay. Also, this called top. So let's implement this. That's that is actually very easy. Uh, we just need a top, okay, and a stack array. So let's make two variable stack array okay oh sorry here we have we should have a type and also let's get a top okay and also size okay and now let's create a construct method Okay, I want to create a constructor method with a parameter. The size, okay, this the top is equal to minus one. Okay, and this dot size is equal to size and this dot stack array is equal to new integer with this dot size. Okay, now that's good. And now let's have a push method. Stack has push method private static void push. Take in push method we push actually uh, a number because our stack type is integer. So for example number then we add them 
to the stack, ok here if we check before this uh, before we adding that we have any empty size or not so we need to check if it is not full ok so when mega method public static or public boolean public boolean is full when the stack can be full the stack actually when the stack is full that the top the the size is equal to top minus one okay okay when size is equal to top minus one it means the stack is full for example and here we first check is full oh, why okay this is this should be static is full if is full if is not full then we add to the stack how to add it is easy just call the stack stack array stack added okay top plus plus is equal to the number as you can see we got it here so now as I think we need also this to make it static okay also we need to static this and also this okay but it is not well let's make this remove now oh, it's okay okay else just return okay what this no matter push okay so this is another problem actually and also we can have public check as empty boolean is empty when the sec is empty when the top is equal to minus one okay this empty and you pop we also have pop okay private and teacher pop actually pop we should check f is not empty because when we want f is empty f is not empty then we should pop okay how to pop just return the stack array of top minus minus okay like this else return for example zero okay
So this is good. Um, now let's make another method. Main method and check it. Let's make an object of this tag class. Okay. And we have a constructor method with a size, for example, size is five. Now I want to add to push, for example, one. Four, five. Now we have five value push. Now let's check it's out s dot smt. It should return false. Okay. SMT okay is fall is fall so let's check it oh what's the problem yeah, we have a problem in stack dot top plus plus top is minus zero. Oh, yes. When we push, first we check small f size is equal to not minus one, it's equal to top. No, actually, this is not a problem. The size is five. One, two, three, four, five. Now we have five value. If this was six, what will happen? No, this is good. So let's comment this right now. Is empty. Mm, true. Yes, empty is full, false. Okay. This is okay. But why push does not work? Well, this is this stack. Oh, yes, yes, we should have plus plus. Okay, now it's good. Is empty false? Empty? No, it is not empty because the size is six, but the element is five. Mm, now is empty, yes. Is empty. False is full. False is full should be no. Now it is full. What the fuck? When this is full, when the size is equal to the top. When the size is equal to the top minus 
one. So let's make a variable integer size return return the size okay and let's check it the size is 5 okay And let's return the top public integer top return top wow. Top. As you can see, top is four. Okay. Why top is four? One, two, three, four, five. So yes here is a problem okay actually size minus one is equal to top okay now that's good yeah now that's good so also we can pop it we can pop it okay for example if we pop You can see the pop number is five because last comes five. Yeah, let's make a display value public void display. Let's make a four. Okay. Actually, this should be on the top. Okay, done out. Stack of I. And now let's yes that display let's have as you can see there is four number okay we have there four number now we have five number okay now if we have added four number then as you can see we have four number just second number as you can see we have just two number yes that's great so thank you for your watching and see you in the next video and then Forget to subscribe my channel, okay? YouTube.com, Barnamim. Goodbye.